recording right now. And I'm going to pop a couple of resources in the chat for you guys. So feel free, again, don't feel like you have to read these right now. You know, I just feel like these are good resources to bookmark for later. I'm going to provide you all with what we call our orientation or my orientation agenda, gives a little overview of some of the aspects of the platform, which I'll touch on today, as well as some support links if you want to take a deeper dive on any specific subject. Additionally, your brokerage has gone above and beyond to give you some of our amazing add-on products. These are things which will most definitely set you apart from other competing agents. Even ones using KV Core, they don't all have these add-on products. So you guys have some uh, amazing equipment to really boost your business with Core Present and Core Listing Machine. So I've also created a little um, add-on products guide popping this in the chat. So the add-on guide just has some supplementary information for you as well. Each of these have a self-paced training course. If you'd like to take those, there's links to a live webinar about those additional products. If you can't catch the live webinar, which I've included the dates and times on here, there's also a recorded version of those live web those live demos and some supplementary support articles as well. So you really have the whole kit and caboodle, however you choose to learn them, use them. Just a good one. I would recommend, again, bookmarking this one for later. I've also provided it to um, your admins, Heather and Rachel, so they'll also have that resource. All right. So I don't want to waste any more time. Now, if I haven't already introduced myself, my name is Mariel Ortiz, and I'm a product trainer here at Inside Real Estate. And furthermore, I'm going to be your dedicated trainer as we go through this KD Core journey. I'm so excited to meet all of you here today. So before we jump into the platform itself, I want to talk a little bit uh, about kind of our philosophy here at Inside Real Estate, our goals with bringing you this platform. Well, we really want you to know that a big goal of ours here at Inside Real Estate is to enhance brand differentiation with this KV Core platform. Uh, I would really like to emphasize that you can customize how you use the platform. Not every agent that gets access to the platform will use it in the exact same ways. As I mentioned in the demonstration portion of today's webinar, I'm going to go through a lot of the bells and whistles available to you, just give you kind of a little tour as to where things are located. So that way it's more familiar when you're jumping in there yourself. Now, this will sound like a lot of information, and sometimes with people that are newer to KV Core, it can feel a little overwhelming. I just want to let you know that don't feel like you have to learn all of this information at once. Take it in bite-sized chunks. So as I'm going through the tour today, I really want you to focus on features that get you excited or features that you can see yourself working into the way that you currently run your business. Learn those, get to know them well, and come back to our additional training resources for more information when you're ready. Additionally, of course, it's a big goal of ours to drive profitable growth for you and your business. That's why your website's not just there to look pretty and show off your listings. It's there to capture leads. That's why your CRM is not just a place to house your contacts, but it's a place of nurture. And of course, we want to be a reliable tech partner to you throughout this whole process. So I'm going to make sure you guys know all the resources you have available, everyone who you can contact, uh, every source of information you can utilize while you're learning the platform. So what does success look like here with KB Core? Well, in part, it's on us to provide that right technology. Really important, when we were building this KB Core platform, we always wanted it to be a one all in one solution, your one stop shop, because it's entirely too common nowadays that agents need multiple tech platforms just to run one business. We really want to eliminate the confusion by having one login where you can do all the work which you need to do. Additionally, because we know as agents, you're always on the go, a lot of these features will be available to you through your mobile apps wherever you are. Now, it's not enough just to give you the keys to the castle. It's also important that we 
give you the right plan, give you the training uh, courses, support team to help you learn your expansive platform. But just know that success will also rely in part on you to perform the right activities. And what I mean by this is it's really up to you to kind of set your own personal goals for what you hope to achieve with the platform. KV Core can make a huge influence in your business. I really want to emphasize that. But it's really up to you for what you hope to, to utilize it for, where you want to see expansion or growth. Additionally, it's going to be up to you to execute, you know, your daily, weekly targets, get in the habit of coming into the platform. There's a lot of automation that'll take a lot of the work off your plates, but do be prepared at the end of the day to still be making a couple of phone calls. And then, of course, it's up to you to, you know, follow along with our training, our live webinars that we'll have and our course that's available to you to help you learn the platform. All right, so as I mentioned, this is your one-stop shop. I don't wanna to spend too much talking about repeat information, which you probably know, but as I mentioned, you guys really have the whole suite of products. You guys have lead gen and nurture capabilities within the platform, not only just the platform itself, but you've got those extra bonus items such as core social, core listing machine that will create, um, individual websites about your listings will post to your social media for you, not only for, you know, if you're posting about a listing, for those of you that, you know, maybe don't have a listing right now, know that there's going to be curated articles posting to your social media, pretty easy to set up that function. And those articles will be kind of more personalized to the areas in which their work, which you're working. So you'll never see information on there that looks like, you know, a robot posted, never going to see information that looks like it's not relevant to the people that are viewing your social media. Additionally, you're going to have access to a very powerful website that's included with the platform. This is ready to go right out of the box, but you can even do some personalizations to the website. I'll talk a little bit about that in a minute. Um, you're going to have a complete CRM, listing tools, um, and some mobile apps, as we mentioned. So speaking of those mobile apps, just a little refresher. I know you probably have gone a little bit into what these are. You get two included with your platform, the first of which is your KD Core app. Now, this is an agent-facing app. This is meant for you. It syncs with your desktop KD Core. And again, it's wherever you are on the go, you can access those tools where you are. So we also sometimes refer to this as the dialer, very efficient for taking the daily call list that KV Core is going to generate for you because it's really good at prioritizing who it is that you should be reaching out to and use that mobile app to quickly, you know, handle that daily call list, call one lead right after the other. Those calls will log automatically in your contacts platforms within your CRM. So you always have a running record of who you've contacted, who you still need to reach out to. Additionally, through the mobile app, you can enable push notifications. So every time you get a new lead, you can speed to that lead and engage with them as you know, very important in this line of business. You can access your smart CRM contacts, your MLS listings, and this is available whether you have an iPhone or an Android. The second mobile app, which I'll refer to you, is our core open house app. Now, this is to do away with the old fashioned pen and paper sign up sheets at your open houses. If anyone's still using those, this is going to feel like a huge improvement because this open house app can be used on any smartphone, tablet, iPad, and it's a secure environment for your open house guests to go and sign up. It will automatically log their contact information into your smart CRM so you don't have to manually enter those contacts, and it's going to follow it up with some key pieces of automation. So it's going to automatically set them up on a search alert. Search alerts in KD Core, as you'll learn, also referred to sometimes as property alerts or listing alerts, all means the same thing, and usually defaults to a weekly email that's sent out with your available listings based on your MLS that match their open house or match their home search criteria, in this case, the open house, which they went and attended. Additionally, we also have some really amazing pre-built 
smart campaigns within the system. Now, smart campaigns in KV Core are not your average email or drip campaign, but really curated, uh, pre-created, customized plans of action. As we go through the demonstration portion, you'll notice that there's smart campaigns just about for every kind of conversation that you'd want to have with a lead from your, you know, your sphere homeowners, uh, your sphere of influence renters, your client sellers, your new lead buyers, you know, because you wouldn't want to correspond with each one in the same way. So in relation to this open house app, we have a smart campaign, the open house smart campaign that's geared directly for those people. And just to give you a little taste of it, about four hours after someone signs up through the app, if you have that smart campaign turn on, it'll just send them a nice little text message thanking them for invite, thanking them for attending the open house. So just little ways that KV Core can kind of work in the background like a digital personal assistant, freeing up time for you to do the things that a computer platform can't. So I think that's enough slides for now. We're going to jump right into the platform. So I'm jumping into my demo platform here. As I mentioned, you guys are all receiving a welcome email right now. That's coming from at no reply at kvcore.com. Now that welcome email is going to have your login information inviting you to the platform, you can go and sign on in. And this is the very main page, which you'll be viewing as soon as you jump on in. Now, as I mentioned, today is going to be a little bit of a tour acquainting you with what these different navigation bars mean on the left. What the heck is a lead engine? What do I, what can I do in the marketing tab? We'll cover a little bit of that here today. But before I lose anyone's attention, just in case anyone's zoning out here, I think the most important thing is I get you well acquainted with the training. How are you going to learn all this? So over here on the right hand side, and I know you guys have had some preview of this information, so hopefully this is just a little refresher. On this module in the right, the KD Core training module, probably my favorite aspect of the platform, but I may be biased. Uh, you're going to find our learning portal. Now, Learning Portal, I like to think of as KD Core University, has all the various courses that we have available within the platform. So if you want to take a deep dive on our advanced email editor, if you want to take a deep dive into website editing, if your focus is, uh, you know, introducing a lender, if you want to I mean, learn more about those add-on products that I mentioned before, Core Present and Core Listing Machine. There are courses in the platform for that. Um, now, you don't have to take a bunch of courses to learn KD Core. I want to reassure you that's always an optional thing. They'll always be available to you. They're all self-paced courses as well. So if you start one, you know, to spend 15 minutes in it and go back to it a couple of days later, it'll save your place. But there is one course I'm going to recommend to everyone here, and it's called the Agent Quick Start course. Now, this Agent Quick Start course is very easy to complete. You go and click on it. It's on that main page. And you go here, click here to start the course. Now, the Agent Quick Start course is made up of, it says six sections here. Five is just a conclusion. Six is webinar replays. I'll explain what that means in just a second here. So it's really made up of four main sections. And each of those four main sections are really just a couple of short videos. Each video is about two to seven minutes long, so not a lot of time to invest. After the videos, there's a little knowledge check. Make sure you understood what you watched and a list of action items. Those action items are really kind of a checklist, things we recommend you try out for yourself in the platform to ensure it all makes sense. I don't know about you guys, but I don't learn best just by watching a video. I find that I really need to roll up my sleeves and try it out myself to ensure it sinks in. So no matter your learning style, you know, visual, oral, you know, kinesthetic, there's tools built within this training to really ensure that it sinks in and that way you're making the most out of your platform. Now, you'll notice after each of these sections, there's also the option to join a live webinar. We hold weekly webinars about each section of this um, Agent Quick Start course. However, 
for our purposes here today or and the next two weeks, you guys have a brokerage exclusive webinars. We call them our kickoff trainings with me that'll cover this information. So here's how it's going to work. Once you get access to your KD Core platform, as I mentioned, I do really recommend jumping into the Agent Quick Start course and just getting started on sections one and two. I know you all probably have really busy schedules. So I honestly recommend don't try to power through this. If you've got 15 minutes a day, spend 15 minutes a day, watch a couple of videos, take any notes if you've got questions. And within a week, you will very easily get through sections one and two, even if you're doing that 15 minutes a day. Then if you have any questions, we'll have a webinar next week, same time that's going to review sections one and two. I'm going to give a live demonstration of things such as how to fill out your profile, make a test lead, set up those smart campaigns, um, and we'll do those actions together. Additionally, if you have specific questions, we can make sure we tackle those questions live. I find that sometimes it's helpful to take the course first because you don't know what you don't know. So having a little preview of the information first helps spark any questions that you may have as you're going along. So that's the way it's kind of formulated to be used. Again, I recommend sections one and two. We'll meet up next week. I'll review that information, and then I'll tell you guys to move on to sections three and four. And throughout this process, you're gonna learn just the basics of your KV Core account, basic setup, um, adding in contacts, setting up those automations, getting familiar with your websites and listings. All right. So I mentioned that there's also a lot of live webinars available to you. Now you guys have already, um, your admins already have the links for our webinars together. Again, you're gonna have two which are exclusive with me, but there's also always continued training if you really want to. You know, six months down the road, you need a refresher on something. You can always head on over to the live training calendar for more information. So if you're someone who prefers a live webinar or over a course, this is a great go-to. Now. I know you guys are probably mostly here at central time. So from the live calendar, you go and choose the time zone, which best applies to you. And just so you know, those agent quick start webinars are split section by section, running Monday through Thursday every single week with the exception of the occasional holiday. Uh, additional, if you want more information, KV Course Success Meetups are great ones. Um, I reteach orientations and there's live webinars about that core listing machine and core present add-on tools I mentioned. So I included those links. You don't have to go to the live training calendar for it. I've included those links in this bonus products training guide, which I popped in the chat. So that's that add-on guide. So you can always access it there or just watch a recorded version. I've included that as well. Or if you want to attend, say a live webinar, they're available here as well. One more cool ask question real quick. Oh yeah, absolutely. Sorry, Rachel, did you have a question? I noticed there was a little bit of, oh. Hey, can you hear me? I can hear you. I was just gonna clarify, when you say live, it's not just gonna be a video of somebody, it's gonna be an interactive if our agents wanna get on there and ask questions. Oh yeah, absolutely. Yeah, anything from the, live training calendar or it says live view training calendar. Those are all live webinars. They're held by various members of our training team. So yes, those are ones where you can actually ask trainers questions as will always be available week after week. I've just mentioned also in this uh, bonus products guide, I've included the link to join the live webinar and I've included the date that those are available. If you're not able to attend a live webinar, I've also included a recording just in case. Cause I know sometimes, you know, maybe you got something going on at that time on Tuesdays or Wednesdays. So um, may not be possible to attend the live ones. So great question. I'm so glad, hopefully that clarified for everyone. A couple more resources I'll point out here. In the live training calendar, there's also links to our Inside Real Estate Facebook group and YouTube channel. The Facebook group is a Facebook discussion group, so really good to synergize with like-minded um, agents, KV Core users, another place to ask questions if you've got them. And then the YouTube channel, as we going 
as we go through our trainings here together, again, we're going to cover a lot of the basics, how to get started in KD Core. If some of that feels like basic information and you're ready to move on to some more advanced um, info, that YouTube channel has hundreds upon hundreds of hours, especially things like advanced marketing strategies and really ways that you can take KD Core to the next level for your business. So I would kind of, you know, there's some basic videos in there as well, but YouTube video, if you're looking for those next level uh, power ups, that's a great resource. All right, one more resource and we'll start on our tour. Thank you guys so much for your patience. I got to point out here in the bottom right hand corner, this is how you access our support team. So this actually just received a little facelift. Uh, you can go and send a message to our chat support team. They are available seven days a week. So if you're, you know, having a question on, you know, your profile or something that, you know, you just can't wait till our live webinar together, feel free to head on over to support. If you see something that you think may be a bug, head on over to support. They should be your first line of defense if you have questions or concerns. Of course, I'm going to be here with your webinars as well. So feel free to bring training related questions for me. I can answer them here as well. So support always available to you. You can also just shoot them an email at kvcore at insiderealestate.com. I've included an article about how to reach support in my webinar agenda for you guys as well. Additionally, if you're wondering where I found all those support articles, I like to use right here, search for help. And you can type in any subject you want more information about, such as say importing your contacts, and I'll pull up that article for you here. One more call I like to make, it's really, um, one of the things I love best about Inside Real Estate and KV Core is it's always a priori priority of ours to continually upgrade and continually improve our product, make it more user friendly. Um, if you want to see about any of the recent updates, you can always view our release notes here. All right, so let's start this little tour. We're going to make our way through the left-hand column. I know you guys have already gotten a little preview of some of the stuff that you can do on this dashboard, things like checking out your activity stream. This is keeping you up to date on what's going on in the platform and on your website. Um, you know, who's viewing listings, who's, you know, where am I getting my new text messages, emails, new leads from. Now we'll get into this a little bit actually in next week's training, and we'll talk a little bit about, you know, making calls through the desktop, um, how you can stay on top of your calls and tasks, things of that um, nature. So we'll talk a little bit about that next time, just so you know, the lots you can do right here from the dashboard. If you've only got 15 minutes, jump into KV Core, you can do, you know, just check out, you know, your daily call list, you can check what new leads you have, you can follow up right here, you know, email call or text, um, you can click on the leads name, maybe you want to reference, oh, you know, have I sent them past emails or text messages? What were we talking about last before you go and follow up? Um, additionally, you can click on the listing itself. You know, maybe this is my client, uh, you know, and I know that they're looking for homes in a specific neighborhood. Maybe I click on this listing so I can send them out similar properties. So lots of ways you can follow up right here. I'm just checking in on the chats. Um, yes, and your activity is based off your individual website. So what you're seeing down here is your activity exclusive to you. You're not seeing anyone else's activity here. So it's really prioritizing just the things that are important to you within your platform. Absolutely. All right. So heading on over to our navigation bar on the left, the very first one, Playbooks also coincidentally on the dashboard. Oh, and I'll point out one more thing. I promised to let you guys know where you'd find all these recordings. They're gonna be in your company announcement section. This is the company announcement section up here. Yours will look just a little bit different because it'll have uh, information about training and the recordings. But that first stop, playbooks. A little introduction as to what playbooks are. Playbooks combine a lot of the tools built within KD Core all together that you can utilize for a specific action. So let me clarify. Uh, right now we've got three playbooks available. Gather your sphere and work your sphere are excellent for if you need to import your sphere of influence contacts, need an easy way to go and 
go back and label them, set them up on automation. It really kind of pulls in all the different tools, all the different ways that you could do that through a KD Core platform. Promote a new listing playbook, probably my favorite. If you do have a listing, this will actually allow you to pull from your listings or technically a team member's listing. Of course, make sure you have permission before you do so. And if you click start promoting, it'll walk you through seven different steps, or they call them plays here, um, different ways to follow up, do everything you can to promote out that listing. So it's going to create an email template that you can send to other agents within your brokerage, see if they have a buyer for your listing. It's going to pre-create email text templates for your own database. It's going to create custom text codes that you can use on print advertising like flyers, postcards, sign writers. That text code, if a lead goes to text it, it's going to capture their phone number, go straight to your smart CRM. You can even kind of choose the follow up which they receive. If your goal is to start posting more on your social media and prove your social media presence, as I mentioned earlier, you guys got those awesome add on products like core listing machine and core social, which will do some auto posting for you. But additionally, if you're looking to post about your listing even more, it's pre-creating a squeeze page and a landing page and actually allows you to post to Craigslist as well with just a couple of clicks. And if you're not sure what squeeze or landing pages are, they're your uh, lead free lead generation tools through the system. I'll point out where they are in just a moment here. And then last but not least, you'll also do things like initiate a seller report so you can keep your seller informed as to what you're doing to promote their listing. So that's just a little taste of playbooks, lots of tools, as I mentioned, built into one playbook. So I like to think of it as the easy button in KD Core, always a good one to point out for anyone who's new to the platform. Now, I know you already have received a little tour of the smart CRM. I just want to remind you that your CRM is an excellent place to bring in all of your contacts. You can really feel comfortable about bringing all of your, your leads, your sphere of influence, you know, other agents, if you want to mass communicate with them, if you have any vendors, maybe you've got a guy for every scenario, you know, a, you know, someone who does roof repair or someone, you know, who does house cleaning, um, whatever the case may be. And you want to be able to occasionally send them messages in mass, you can really feel comfortable about bringing everyone into your smart CRM, into your database. And it helps keep you organized. I know I'm definitely guilty of a person that, you know, puts contact information on a sticky note, or, you know, I know some agents are still using a Rolodex out there. Maybe you've got contacts in your phone, having them all in one place, all in the CRM specifically allows me to see at a glance the source where they came from, the date they were added. If they came in through my website, I can easily search by that. I can pull up their property interests the last time they visited, last time I gave them a phone call. I can keep track of how many emails, text messages, calls they've received. You can also mass email and text through here. So if I just want to shoot out an email real quick, I could very easily just check off everybody on this first page, shoot them an email right now. You'll notice that KD Core has lots of pre-created templates for you, or you can write your own custom message if you'd like. Now, it's not always practical to just check everybody off on a list and send them the same sort of message. So you've got a lot of handy filters to get you, um, allow you to filter, search and sort, get really specific and granular as to who it is you're reaching out to. So if I've got a new listing, I may want to pinpoint my active leads, those actively searching for homes. I may want to get more specific, maybe want to pinpoint just my buyers or, you know, if it's a rental property, just my renters. Something that's really good to get familiar with early on in your KD Core journey is hashtags. Now, I know you guys came from Chai. My apologies off the top of my head. I can't remember what you guys might consider hashtags. Hashtags are really just your own individual, your custom labels, categories, buckets, however you used to refer to it, um, are your hashtags here at KD Core. It's any phrase of your choosing which you want to be able to filter or sort your contacts by. The only exception with hashtags is 
there's no space and a hashtag. So if you previously sorted your database by hot or cold leads, you know, who was on a farm list or a credit repair program, if you know in your database you've got a number of contacts that are looking to buy a home in spring of 2023, that would make an excellent hashtag. Allows you, you know, come January to go pull up everybody with that tag and get to work on engaging with them. So hashtags, great resource. Feel free to start tagging your leads as they come in, allows you to search and sort, and you could even have some follow-up automation triggered by those tags. More on that in a minute. Additionally, I can search by who's a phone and email. I think you guys are already made aware that you can automate birthday messages through the system. So if you're not sure who in your database doesn't have a birthday, you can go and filter for that, reach out to them, get those dates added in there and make sure that they're being sent a little email or text on that date. So you look like that rock star agent that never forgets a date. Additionally, you can search by if they have alerts, reportings, looked, did actions on your website, their property interests. And again, another time saver, if there's a filter you find that you reach for quite commonly, you can save that filter. You can even pin it to the top. So when you come to your smart CRM, you can really quickly just go to the contacts you want to engage with that given day. Additionally, you've got your listings in here, your listings tab. Again, this is going to be connected to your MLS. You're going to add your MLS ID through your KD Core profile. We're going to get into that next week. Um, and once you have your MLS connected, there you go. Another thing that you don't have to, another window you don't have to have open on your computer. You don't have to go sign into your MLS. You can access those listings here. Again, you've got filters. So you can search and sort, can email and text these out in mass. I can click on, say, a particular listing. I'm trying to find a cute one here. <laughs> See a gallery map, similar listings by photo image and physical description, nearby listings. If you're looking just, you know, my client loves the neighborhood. Matching buyers, kind of a cool one. It's reverse prospecting. So something you'll notice as you use KV Core is all of these tools are built to work together to communicate with one another. So my listings tab is communicating with my smart CRM. By going to matching buyers, I'm quickly pulling up all the contacts in my database whose search criteria matches this listing here so I can easily pinpoint who I should be following up with. Additionally, for more actions, you have tools such as the ability to generate a QR code for this listing. You can print a flyer, you know, single click. There we go. Flyer has been created for me. I'll skip along rather than waiting for that to load. Um, additionally, I can post to social media with a click. Just another way to post to social media. I want to keep reminding you guys, you do have core listing machines. So some of this will be automated for you. But if you want, it never hurts to kind of take the initiative for yourself. You could do it that way. One thing that's really cool that I really love here is our Craigslist auto poster. I don't know if you guys use Craigslist or not. Um, it's a add on it's a one time download it's a little browser extension so this little kd core icon in the corner i download it set it up once and with a single click it auto magically creates a craigslist posting in a matter of seconds it's going to populate the photo image the location of the listing it's going to add in the description and it's going to take it one step further underneath there's a little message that says please text Marielle, that's my name, to this number for more details and photos of this property. That's called a text code. Now, we talked about that a little bit in the promoter listing playbook. If someone texts my name to this number, they're going to get captured. That phone number is going to get captured into my smart CRM. Um, I'm going to be notified that I have a new lead. And again, I can start that follow-up process. So really easy. Another way to um, promote out your listings, um, get in touch with more leads. Now, moving right along. Marketing is your automation hub. So marketing for your automation. Um, that's where you're going to see features like birthdays and automated home anniversary emails and texts. So I mentioned you can automate birthday messages, but you can do the same for their last closing date or the day that they purchased their home. 
Now, these are all pretty easy to set up. You know, just take one second to review it, turn it on, it's ready to go for you. Scheduled mass emails is a fun one as well. If you want to take, you know, 20, 30 minutes on the weekend, and maybe, maybe you've always wanted to have a monthly newsletter in the platform, you could go and you could use our newsletter template, choose the date you want that newsletter to send out and kind of set it and forget it because KB Core will send it out on the day. I really like scheduled mass emails for holiday emails. Of course, reminding you of Core Listing Machine or social, they're going to send out um, some holiday postings to your social media, but this is a different way to approach it. Um, smart campaigns here, as I have mentioned, are your, they're different from your average text or email drip campaign. They really combine a whole sequence. This is another thing that we'll touch on in our training next week. Just to give you a brief overview, as I mentioned, KD Core has pre-created a lot of campaigns for you. If you want to start using any of these, head on over to the KD Core library, and you can really just kind of go and pick and choose the ones which you want to use. All you have to do is click Add to my library. If you want to find out the specific actions, you just click on the name in blue. It'll open up the descriptions, show you exactly what emails or text message it sends out. Here's also where you would find that open house smart campaign. So if I wanted to use that in conjunction with the open house app, I would go add to my library, head on over to my campaigns, and all I got to do is turn it on. Now you also have the ability to tweak or personalize these however you like. I want to emphasize these are tried and tested to produce results exactly as they are. There's no need to reinvent the wheel. But if you're someone who you know, maybe you're reading a couple of these messages and you're thinking to yourself, oh, you know, I don't know if that's exactly what I would say. <laughs> oh, there we go. Now it decides to load. Took me a quick second. Maybe you're looking at a message and you decide, oh, you know, that's not exactly what I want to say. If you go and you grab that campaign from our KD Core library, you have the ability to edit those messages. There's inline editing right here. And when you save the changes, it saves it as a template. So you could use that again and again. Additionally, you can adjust the time it sends out. You could remove a couple steps, add in actions. We'll learn all about this in future trainings. You could, again, kind of an advanced step, not some, it's not something that, you know, maybe everyone wants to take the time to do. Maybe something you might come back and do later. You can also create a campaign entirely from scratch. And you can utilize things like those hashtags or those custom tags that you create in the, in the system to have, say, an automated email campaign start as soon as a lead is given a specific hashtag. More on how this all pieces together in just a minute. Now, well, automation sounds great, but you need leads in the system to automate. So you're going to head on over to Lead Engine for that process. This is where you would go for our free lead generation tools, text codes, landing pages, and squeeze pages. Now, I think you guys got a little preview of a landing page during your excitement call with Jeff. Um, landing pages are kind of like those standalone websites. You can really kind of narrow down who it is you're advertising to, you know, whether that be you know, your niche audience, maybe your target is, you know, you want to find more leads looking for fixer upper listings in a particular area. Um, I've had agents that have created landing pages for, you know, to get people to sign up for news, their newsletter at a trade show, you just showcase it on say an iPad, get people to sign up that way. Maybe you want to promote, you know, a teacher affiliation program that you have or some other sort of discount program, first time home buyer seminar, list goes on and on. Squeeze pages are more so, um, again, you're creating a link that uh, will entice users to come back to your website, whether that be to look at multiple listings, single listing, sign up for a home valuation or a market report. But additionally, just so you know, um, besides generating new leads, you can also um, bring in, you know, if you have, say, an outside third-party lead source, maybe Zillow, Realtor.com, Soul.com, 
any of those dot coms. KV Core doesn't care where your leads come from. You can sync those leads. So every time you get a new lead, they enter directly into your smart CRM and you can follow up with them here. Again, it's always our goal that this is your one stop shop. So you don't have to use a, mul a multitude of different tech solutions to keep in top of your database. Additionally, I really want to point out, we'll get into this more in future trainings, but you can import bulk import a file or a spreadsheet of contacts, bring them all into your CRM at once. You can also individually add contacts, we'll learn about manually adding a contact next time. But if you've got a file or a spreadsheet, you know, contacts from Chime, your email, your phone, just so you know, um, while there's options to bring those in yourself, there's videos, there's guides here. We also provide you with a team we call them lead configuration specialists that will actually edit your files, import them into your CRM, and send you an email once it's complete. This is a totally free service. It's included no matter how many files you have. You just go and fill out a short submission form. Um, and then additionally, I'm getting a little note here. Um, just so you know, you can reach out to Rachel for help with that piece or any other issues may, you may have. So. You've got multiple resources for this. So this is a pretty simple process. I will go over it in our second kickoff training. I'll actually walk through the submission form. It really just asks a couple of questions, but I'll provide some clarification. Uh, additionally, you've got Rachel, who's got your back through this process, and you can even book a one-on-one -on -one Zoom screen share with a lead configuration specialist. So kind of like what we're doing here, except it's just you and that lead configuration specialist. It's a Zoom meeting. They'll send you a link. You can actually share your screen, show them the file you're working with, get their expert advice. Um, Web and IDX. Now we've got some um, exciting news. You guys have your websites live. Rachel, I hope you don't mind. I'm showcasing your website here. And wow, do they look beautiful. So just a little preview, your websites are live. When you go and log in, you've got some really cool features on here. I'll, I'll show you mine in future trainings as well. Mine's not nearly as fancy as yours. You've got some beautiful widgets, um, areas to explore, lots of places uh, for lead capture, some beautiful listing carousels. And yours just has a, a really professional um, on-brand look look to your websites. A little preview of mine. I've actually updated this for Halloween. We'll see. There we go. The background's loading. Just so you know, with your web and IDX section in your platform, you have the ability to customize say the background image, you could pop in a YouTube video for the background. You can adjust the widgets, the custom colors. Now you probably don't need to really do any of that because Gee, look at your websites. Those are beautiful. But additionally, if you wanted to perk up the website, you can connect, you can add in testimonials, connect Zillow reviews, you can adjust those listing carousels, um, and really just so much more. Um, if you do want to do your own personalized touch, you can blog through your website, you can add in custom pages, maybe you want to showcase some vendors, maybe work out a little deal with a vendor. Hey, I'm going to showcase you on my website in exchange. How about you, you know, give me a discount, a coupon, something I can share with my clients. So lots of ways that you could go above and beyond. I want to remind you guys, you don't have to make a bunch of edits. Your website's ready to go right out of the box. But this is where you would go if you did want to make those customizations. Um, again, reach out to Rachel with help for personalization. Um, and she's, uh, she's designed and worked with the team to create the ones that are currently set up. But yes, lots of options here. Pretty easy to blog add testimonials, custom pages, um, edit your official settings. Um, none of this really requires any sort of advanced coding knowledge. They try to make it pretty easy and user-friendly for everyone. Additionally, your marketplace is where you would go for any sort of purchasable add-on. So everything I've talked about right so far is all included with your platform. Those are all free features, I also apologize, forgot to mention um, this marketing tabs also where you would go to access your core present. That's your award-winning CMA and presentation builder. 
And this is also where you would go to access your core listing machine to set that up. Not a place where you have to go back and visit a lot. It usually requires kind of a one-time setup. You're going to connect your social media feeds to it um, or those links and choose what articles you want to send out. And it's pretty much a set and forget it feature. But yeah, I apologize. That was back in your marketing tab. But marketplace, if you did find that, you know, oh, you know, free DIY lead generation sounds great. I just don't have the time. There are options to purchase leads through KV Core. There's options for um, Facebook ads, Google pay-per-click pay ads. I think you guys already have access to Property Boost, probably my favorite purchasable add-on. Additionally, there's the option for one-on-one -on -one help, coaching sessions, handwritten postcards, additional add-ons to your website if you really want to. So lots to look at in the marketplace. If it is an interest of yours, it's not really going to be a focus of my training. Um, but if it is an interest of yours, we do hold a uh, daily Monday through Friday marketplace overview webinar that will go take a deep dive into that. Last stop along our journey is business analytics. And I'm going to go through this real quick because I know you guys have already had a glimpse of how that works. Last, but I'll also point out here support and training. A lot of the same links we saw in that dashboard, access to the support center, which is all those articles. So I also pointed out through the chat, if you go search for help, same thing as the support center. Webinar schedule is all those live webinars. And learning portal is all those self-paced courses. Again, I call that KB Core University. So we just try to give you multiple options to reach whatever tool you're looking for, because not everybody thinks automatically to click in the same place. Now, source performance is going to keep you on top of which lead sources are producing the most leads, which ones are converting to contacts, or sorry, converting to clients, which ones are you closing out a deal with. KV Core Activity is keeping you on top of your automation engagement. It can quickly point out who is not being engaged through the system, who's not receiving a search alert or a market report. Kind of cool. There's a little arrow on the side. Again, another benefit of all these pieces being connected. If I click on this little blue arrow to the side of search alerts, it's going to take me back to my smart CRM. It's going to pinpoint who's not receiving those messages so I can follow up with them here. And then also highly recommend consumer interest. If you want to check out, you know, what people are looking at, say listings, areas, price points to your website to kind of enhance your marketing strategy, consumer interest is a great one for that as well. So let's wrap it up. I always think these are going to take less time than they do. And I just get so excited to talk about KV Core. I could go on and on. If this was a lot of information, I'm going to back it on up. If all of this went one ear in one ear and out the other, here's the big takeaway I want you guys to get from this. We're starting with the Asian Quick Start course. It's going to tell you the basics, the need to know about all of these aspects. So you've got a general knowledge of everything you need to do. You don't have to use every single tool I showcased here today. And I'm going to explain how a lot of this works in greater detail in our next two webinars together. So Agent Quick Start, again, is where I recommend you guys to start. That's available through the main dashboard right here under Agent Training. When you guys get access to your platform and log on in, I highly encourage just starting on sections one and two. And even if you've only got 15 minutes a day, you're going to be right on target for our meeting next week where I review that information live. So Agent Quick Start is where I recommend you start. You can also download the mobile apps now. You'll use the same logins for those mobile apps as you would um, your KD Core login. And you can probably find those through you know, the app store, but just a little keynote right here on this main dashboard. Uh, you can click on the download mobile app and there's actually a way you can text yourself these links. So just to make sure you find the right apps and easily download them, just go through the dashboard and text yourself the links. Make it easy for yourself. Additionally, remember our next two trainings. I've got the dates and times up on the screen. We'll be meeting next week, same time, November 3rd. 
Thank you guys so much for your time, your attention. I appreciate you so much. I'm so excited to uh, really get your feedback, your questions as we move along with this training. Now, I'm happy to hang out for a minute or two if you guys have additional questions. Really, I could hang out to the end of the um, hour. Oh, it looks like we've got a little um, announcement here. Yeah. Sorry, I just saw a message from Rachel here. Yeah, just let me know. I, I can unmute them or you can unmute them. That way we can pop in a little comment here. Someone wanted to say something before we close on up. Additionally, if you guys have any questions, pop those in the chat. We've still got some time left. Hey, can you hear me? I can hear you. Sorry, I can hear me now. Oh, yep, I can hear you. Um, Linda uh, and the team just wanted to make sure that everyone was aware that whatever um, the plan that they're on now in regards to CRM and website and all that, it's um, staying the same. So if we, uh, if they have any questions to reach out to myself or Heather or Linda or Audrey, and um, we'll be happy to answer them in regards to all of that. But we just appreciate everybody's time and um, be sure and check out your own personal website because they look really good. They do. Those are some beautiful websites. <laughs> all right. Um, as I mentioned, that's all I have here today. If you guys have any questions, please pop those in the chat um, or bring your questions to our next webinar, whichever you prefer. Um, I'm going to hang out for a minute or two, just in case anyone's a slow typer, you could also raise your hand and I'm happy to unmute you if that's preferred. So I'm going to hang out for a minute or two. I'll probably just pop back on the background music. So we're not just listening to the sound of me breathing. <laughs> if this was all you came here for today, you don't have any further questions. Uh, again, you're free to leave. Thank you guys so much. And I look forward to meeting with you again next week. Take care. All right, before we wrap up here, Rachel has a little something that she'd like to show on her screen. Oh, and Rachel, uh, if you're explaining this, just so you know, you are muted right now. So it looks like Rachel's given a little tour of those new Avast websites. So just giving you guys a little preview as to what your websites will be looking like when you go and jump into the platform. Again, these are already ready up and running. Uh, we'll talk a little bit about 
adding your MLS ID to your profile next time. And that's just going to make sure that everything functions correctly through the search tab on your website. Additionally, we're going to add in your photo images, you know, your about me. So each of your websites really look personalized to you. So just a little, little. Hey, um, I'm just showing some agents here in our Hoover office, their website. Perfect. Yep. So sorry, just giving a little feedback on that as she's scrolling.